Welcome back everyone. Welcome back to Let's Play Miasma Chronicles. We're in the uh, party palace of Diesel D, of the late Diesel D, because, well, we've bested him. And uh, yeah, Mason, the mayor, is quite good. Wow, there's a lot of plastic here. So this is where Diesel <clears throat> keeps his plastic. Tempting. It is tempting, and we're gonna take it all! Gotta have me some of that. Ooh, Battle E damage rounds 2. Increases weapon damage by 20. I like that. That's a lot of plastic we're getting. The oh. miasma's closing in. We should hurry. Oh, you hear some kind of miasma whisperer? It whispers to me. Or yells incessantly. That's crazy. Pick it all up. More plastic. Alright, there's more stuff here. And of course, we leveled up as well. And it was an achievement to get to level <clears throat> 25, excuse me. So I'm guessing. Yeah, it even says so up at the top, max level. Sweet. That's a shame. Gold chain. Seen as both a status symbol. Oh, look, it's 25,000 XP. And uh, we can't really get any more. As both a symbol and the solid gold guarantee of punctuality. This chain was cherished by Diesel D, even though the clock's mechanism stopped working decades ago. Plastic, plastic, that looks cool. It's even got like a red thing on the top. What else do we got apart from that chest here? Ooh, orange. Contract. Let's see what we have. <clears throat> It is hereby oh. agreed that management of the production facility known as the first factory, its surrounding warehouses, workers, and local suppliers are now under the jurisdiction of Diesel Diomedes X5 and his associates, directly reporting to Quendel Zen and the first family. This agreement has been made with the understanding that production is uninterrupted and the output of the site increases by 10 to 15 percent annually. Quendel Zen approves this message. Interesting. 10 to, uh, to 15 percent annually yeah that's good luck with that uh do we have anything more here we've got some plastic yeah it's a shame but it seems like the uh the factory is going to be the final place the final fight maybe or maybe we go up onto into space that would be cool addendum what's the addendum to ensure a substantial output that can be scaled to meet future production demands, steps will be taken. The weak links removed, replaced with the strong. All workers within the grounds of the DRC are deemed property of the first family and can be used, consumed, or otherwise dealt with by a manner seen fit by the foreman. Quendel Zen approves this message. Lovely. Consumed. What the hell? Look at this place. I'm uh, actually surprised Diesel D decided to uh, stay here at this palace. Cobalt unit. Ooh, meet up with Maxis. Wait, 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 wait. We still haven't found all the pieces for that weapon we were supposedly building. I guess there's going to be quests we will not actually finish. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, hello. This looks good. Level 3 shotgun. Adds 15% crit chance per target. Adds one tile when moving, two when sprinting. Very nice. The body of this custom Syntex shotgun is made of an ultralight composite material with it, which increases maneuverability on the battlefield. Its previous owner must have had a thing for long scaly lizards and had one painted on the sound on the side. Painted. Not painted. Um, Alright. Well, let's see. We also have to level up, of course. Um, so this shotgun compared to the lizard shotgun, come on, ooh, this one has crit rounds and this one would need the, uh, hmm, 10% critical chance, increased weapon damage by 10, we could just give you the second one for the extra damage. Uh, we've got this, and we've got the extended range. Ten kilowatt of energy. I wonder if I should give him a shotgun here. 
I mean, the Vefa is very sort of situational and doesn't do quite enough damage, I feel. Um, hmm. All of these have empty slots, so let's give you the Dragon Shotgun. Give you the increased weapon damage. Okay. So, let's see the uh, skills. We only have one more skill, which sucks because I can't really get anything. Oh, man. Flanking shots. We can get 20 kilowatts of energy or extra kilowatts. Let's do that for now. You can get the automatically punch back. I suppose we can do that. I've got the extra movement. I've got the overwatch, but meh. Every time a turn is skipped, I'm, I don't skip turns, so let's give you more health. And uh, born again and pumped up. Here is immune to knockback. So what is that? Uh, where is it? This one, a rotor shot. Stacking 20% critical chance for consecutive shots from the same targets. Okay. Um, hmm. The self-service is nice as well. High ground shots. Nothing really to spend it on, to be honest. So, oh well. It's just gonna have to stay without it, I suppose. Alright. Wow, the whole place is emptied. Damn. Well, she's still here. Oh, and that guy is still here. I'm not gonna relax. Don't hurt me. I'm I'm just a number cruncher. A nobody. Relax. Why didn't they run? Lose fifty plastic. <laughs> Alright, the thing is we still have a lot of places we haven't explored though. I don't know if that's something for the future. I mean, maybe after the first factory, we still have to go places? I don't know. Hello? I forgot to remove them. All right, let's, let's see. Because you can see an explored location. That's the first factory. Uh, we've got this place here. Um, we should definitely explore that. We've got all these completed. All these completed. Wait, so everything is just completed? Wait, show available quests. Gunsmith and the Watchers. We have to find the Watchers. Okay, so let's go over here to the Breakfast Club and then go down there. See if we can find anything. Maxis and his fighters are waiting for us at the gate to the loading dock now that we have the foreman's access card. Meet up with Maxis. Look at this ship. Looks so cool. Oh, wait. What am I doing? Uh, that's just an overlook, right? Oh, there's people there. Or robots, maybe. So, let's see. Where is this special area? Oh, Warden. What are these guys doing here? Have I not been here before? Oh, and that thing as well. I thought I had. Hmm. Let's switch to her. So nobody will see this, right? Um, so we have to zap him first. And mute assault. Yeah, I'll just do.
We have another Miasma ability there, which is nice. Nice critical. And of course the Ice Gun. Pew! Nemesis. Uh, let's try this again. Shut down imminent. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, ooh. Uh, he's gonna wake up. I don't like that. Yeah, I don't like that. Uh, hydraulic leap is not silent. Well, whoops. Now I'll have to wake them all up. Yeah, that trooper there. Well, whoops. Because that guy is going to wake up now and get everyone here. Well, actually, you know what? Let's wait. Let's see if he does. I mean, Overwatch is going to alert. Oh, yeah, exactly. There we go. So I was right. Good. Uh, let's finish him off. Excellent. Silent kill. And some rage. Oh, plenty of them here. Oh, general. Unlock all enemy codex entries. There we go. General. 30 years ago, this collector was ordered to guard a site until it was secure. The command to stand down never came. Decades later, decades later it's still guarding. Teleports additional collectors into the battlefield can leap up one level. I don't like that. Green fingers. Sophisticated gardener bot who enjoys nurturing all forms of plant life. Although he despises human life, robots too because their hubris hurts the plants. He can hear the plants scream. That's from the gauntlet, these guys. Nobody knows for sure if the triplets are really triplets. Not many have dared to ask. As long as Gauntlet fans can relish the thrill of their sniper rifle kills, it doesn't really matter. Iron Gloves? When champion Thor Munson had to drop out of the Gauntlet, the second rank gladiator automatically moved to the top. Now his chance to show the DRC how a real champ rocks the show. Well, not. Unstable, cook-wearing, frog-themed headwear. Uh, he hopes to ingratiate himself within, within the Grabber's tribe and express his love for their culture. What happens in the swamp stays in the swamp. Oh, no. Oh, enemy will notice you. Ah, they'll notice me if I pick that up. Interesting. I thought I'd been to this place before, but I guess... I guess not. Breakfast club. Weird. Oh, we can climb up here? Yeah. Okay. Come on. Can climb up there as well, I guess. No. Okay, that guy's gonna come back. Ah, there's the uh, exit towards that area where we haven't been to yet. <coughs> I want the higher ground here. Come closer. Come on. Ambush. Ooh. Okay, ambush. She goes first, even though she is not hidden, is she? I'll handle this. You've got to be Stay kidding cool, me. My day. Well, he's not immune to EMP, so that's okay. Silent. They do look very cool, and they have this sort of ancient Egyptian um, sort of theme to them. I feel all of them. I don't do warning shots. Oh, really? Only forty. Nice. Another one bites the rust. 
Is she stuck? Yeah, she is. Okay, we're gonna have to go far away enough for her to uh, rejoin us. There's stuff in there. Yeah, I don't remember this place at all. I guess we just sort of passed through. Breakdown! EMP grenade, which I haven't used at all, but probably will in the factory. Or maybe not. Maybe once again I'll just, you know, forget. Or just not use it, because I think I like, oh, I'll need it somewhere else. As per usual in these types of games. <laughs> Last refuge. Come on. I didn't think they would come back here after they closed the facility. I hear the voice of the miasma. It tells me they are near the first family's metal monsters outside. I hear the scratching. They are digging their way in. I need to wait, yes. Maybe they will leave and then I can make my move. Oh, wow. That's creepy. General. There's the general. I need to check if there's any other enemies around first. I think there are. So who was this that was hiding here that was so important for them to assign this general? Also, what is that? It looks cool, that antenna type thing. Oh, it looks toward the miasma. Okay. So if I pick it up, will they hear me? Yes, enemy will notice you. Okay. That's kind of cool, though. We've never seen Miasma where we could pick it up without immediately uh, fighting enemies, and yeah, it's cool. Can I use this? Recon from Drone 17. Camp sighted. Send investigation unit. No, they will not hear it. There's a diner here. Can we climb up there? I think we can. Okay, now he goes there. Oh shoot, he goes here. And just use the explosive barrel. The Breakfast Club. I heard this was a prison for kids. <laughs> okay, we oh we can just go up here, I suppose. Troupa. All right, let's make sure this time that it's 100%, shall we? Oh, this guy is not immune to EMP. Pew! Nice. 125 crit. Jeez. Love it. When I was, uh... When I was pulling these guys from their group uh, quite a few episodes ago... You know, one by one, and then taking them out. I love that one comment that said, um, Alpha 1, go investigate. Uh, what, what's that noise? And then later on, um, or not Alpha 1, like, Alpha, go investigate. And then Beta, go investigate what happened to Alpha. And then Gamma, go investigate what happened to, uh, <laughs> to Beta. And so on, and then just, wait, where is everyone? <laughs> sure we're oh. What the hell? Holy... Oh, that, that's cool. I wish we could get that as a party member. <laughs> Alright, let's go take care of the general there. Now, this is going to be an open fight. So... <clears throat> uh, bum, 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 bum. I should really try her for a little bit. And use her abilities against robots. And she's got a cool, really cool uh, outfit. Alright, how are we going to do this? This is not a good place to hide. Hmm. Surprisingly, he doesn't have that much armor. Now, high ground is nice, but yeah. 
And the problem is, that guy is going to call reinforcements, which sucks. We'll pick up. Come on. So, it would be nice if we could take him out as fast as possible. Uh, we'll have to fight from this side. Scouting ahead. So is this just one? Yeah, this is just one area. Hold back. We're gonna go here with your little shotgun, and I guess you can hide over here for now. All right. So what can she do? She can do coach. Increased critical chance for the next shot. Electro chainer. That's gonna be useful. But of course. Uh, the general is immune to EMP stun. Electro channel might be quite useful though. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, an EMP shot. I'm gonna coach first. Oops. Coach him. Coach Diggs. Oh, that was cool. And then do the electric chainer. Because that is going to also uh, desize them, I believe. Oh, it won't. I thought it would. And of course, I, I've done the mistake because now he will be seen. And I will not get the extra crit, will I? Oh, actually, I can just stay here. Hydraulic leap. But that guy... Huh. Is he not immune to that? Oh, nice! He's not immune to that. The only unfortunate thing is now we can't really use the shotgun. Excellent. Wait, what's that? Oh. Um, hmm. Well, let's try this, I suppose. Nice. I should have used the armor eater shot first. 62 only. Gotta get closer, but that guy's gonna get up. 70 percent. Okay, don't miss, please. Nice. Alright. We've got this turn to take him out. Otherwise, he uh, gets back up and... Calls for reinforcements. So, this guy we cannot really knock back. Hmm. <laughs> Go over here, use the shotgun. Wait, what? Oh, use a the shotgun. There we go. It's not gonna be enough though, is it? Nice critical. Oh, we could just, I think, take the general out, even though that EMP shot would be super useful here. Balance. Ninety-four. Sniper. Come on. Oh, nice. Oh, I think we can take him out. But we're going to have to take some damage because we want to make sure that this is going to be a sure shot. I mean, it's not a sure... What are these? Oh, there's, uh, like, stuff there that can explode. Um, yeah, don't miss. I could just use the glove shock here. Nice. That was a general. Oh, you're going for digs? He's got a shotgun, though. Oh, okay. Well, uh, 
Sure. How much from there? Ah, oh, you have to reload, of course. Wait, I didn't give you I'm a out. second weapon. <laughs> oh, well, that was... That was silly. Okay. So we have to glove shock him. Shut down imminent. 93%. Well, that was much better than I thought it was going to be. We took no damage. Bomadi. Shut down imminent. Excellent. Yeah. You, my friend, are pure dynamite. Elvis is enraged. And now we get a mi miasma power as well. Let's see what it is. Miasma power. Hell yeah. What is it? Green fingers. Oh. Collect all miasma types. Grow an adult whisperer. Oh, no need for a pet soil, uh, pot, soil, or fertilizer. This miasma power will instantly summon an adult whisperer to assist you in battle. Now let the tree hugging commence. That's quite powerful. Okay. Uh, wow, I'm kind of disoriented. There we go. <laughs> because that miasma was gone. What's that up there? That effect. I think that's the EMP effect from that guy. It's weird. The first thing you got to do is walk right into it if you don't know what it is. Look, it's following us. We've got a pet electrical cloud thingy. Hello, bot. This bot's as old as this diner. Science has damned us. The end of the world is here. History accessed. What's the last thing you remember? Our last customer spewing gunk out of his mouth. First customer in weeks. What do you know about the collapse? Same as you. Big breakdown in the great stability. The glitch to end all glitches. You think Edison would take responsibility for their mistake? No. It's all profits to them. I was built for paradise, not whatever this shit is. Turn me off. <laughs> Two orders of blueberry pancakes. Hold the blueberries. State your purpose. <sighs> Read the name tag. DD. Waitress at the Breakfast Club. Plenty of room to make yourselves comfortable. We're out of coffee. Think you're out of everything. Doesn't surprise me. Everything broke after the collapse. <laughs> oh, I can talk for days about Edison. After the collapse, where were they? Up in their sky castles playing video games? Didn't even have the decency to shut me off. Sorry. Thank you. Sleep in the cloud. Ooh. Well, thank you very much for watching. We're going to continue next time. Big thank you to my patrons, as always. Ooh, bacon candy bar. The originals had technology... Oh, collect every treasure. Had technology that was awe-inspiring. None more so than the ability to make candy taste like bacon. Many modern alchemists have tried and failed to replicate this amazing feat, making the original a very valuable item. <laughs> yes, thank you very much for watching. Big thank you to my patrons, and I will see you all in the next part when we go attack the guys with a big guy. Bye-bye.